What's going on guys? It is Nick with Sneakerfly and we are back with another sneaker review today. Uh, today we're going to be taking a look at a shoe that I actually picked up from Sneakerhead in the Bay. Uh, I'm sure anyone watching this video knows who he is, uh, but if you don't, Sneakerhead in the Bay is a bigger shoe YouTuber. Uh, he does vlogs, sneaker reviews, anything basically like you see on our channel he does, but he just has way more subscribers than us. So. Uh, yeah, so I picked these up from him. Um, he has an online store where he sells any shoes that he's just looking to get rid of from his collection or uh, miscellaneous things, uh, stickers or whatever. I'll throw um, the website in the bio, so if you want to check it out, you can. He always has stuff on there. Uh, but he threw these shoes up for a steal, so I had to jump on them because I knew they were legit and they were in great condition. I haven't seen many in this good of condition, so um, I jumped on them and got them. Uh, so let's take a look at the shoes. Today we have in the Yeezy 350 Zebra colorway. Um, these shoes are insane. Uh, I was just talking to Landon about these actually, and they're they're really really easy to wear. They're really wearable, but they're loud at the same time, and that's what I like about them. Um, I like shoes that go with anything because trying to I feel like it's just a waste having shoes that you only wear with certain outfits here and there, uh, just because you're you're not wearing that shoe that much. So something like this you can wear with anything. It matches anything. Uh, so yeah, it's really, really dope. Um, getting into the shoe itself, you have the All Zebra Upper. Um, I'm sure many of you have seen this. This shoe released a long time ago, but I'll throw in some B-roll and stuff so you can check them out. But on the whole shoe, you have the Zebra Upper. Um, on the outside, you have the uh, Supply 350 in the red, which I like. It makes it kind of pop um, on the outside and that solid white stripe underneath that. Um, on the inside of the shoe, it kind of gets into the crazy zebra pattern a little bit more. Uh, that really pops. That's what I really like about the shoe. Um, the back, of course, you have the hill tab um, with the black dots across it. And white laces. I wish they came with extra laces, but they don't. Uh, but it is pretty pretty nice. I've seen actually laces from uh, Rope Lace Supply that you can throw in that really makes a shoe pop. Uh, so that's an option for you. But I, I like the white laces too. It, it's simple. keeps it clean. Um, then you have the simple um, Adidas Yeezy branding on the insoles. And the outsole is like a creamy white colorway. Um, and like I said, these were in, I think on the website, 9.5 out of 10 condition. Uh, and I would agree. I mean, the bottoms are crazy clean. If I wipe these off like a crap wipe or something, they would look brand new. Um, so shouts out to Sneakerhead in the Bay for actually uh, listing a shoe that was that condition. I know a lot of people always say, oh, 9 out of 10, and you get them and they're like beat to shit. So... Shout out to him for actually selling something that um, was in great condition and like he said it was. Uh, so yeah, they, the only downfall with this shoe that I don't like about it personally um, is how yellow the soles get over time. Uh, I wish I wish they could say that whole cream color and also the back of the, um, the midsole. It has like that, there's like one piece that has like a slight yellow tint. Um, I know it's not that noticeable, but it, I just don't like it. it kind of throws off the midsole for me with that it kind of like a piss color I don't really like it. Um, that's the only complaint I have about this shoe. Everything else is dope uh, This shoe is really clean. You really can't go wrong with it It's gonna match anything like I had said and also it's gonna catch a uh, catch some attention out in public Which is always nice, you know, you can flex every once in a while with these that's for sure uh, but yeah, that pretty much sums up the review. I know it's kind of short and sweet. Uh, it's just These are just really basic, and I know everyone's seen these a thousand times since they released a long time ago. Uh, but I thought I'd just throw up a quick review since I got them in. Uh, so yeah, if there's anything you want to see from us, anything that we can do differently, uh, throw it in the comments. Uh, let us know, and we'll try to get that done for you. But until next time, I'm out.